Hey everyone, thanks for taking a few minutes to take a quick look at how Clio Integration Cloud helps eliminate manual integrations as well as automate integrations into your in the entire ecosystem. When we say entire ecosystem, we're talking about both your enterprise ecosystem, which would be consisting of you know, maybe on-premise systems, ERPs, TMSs, as well as cloud-based uh, applications that you might have as part of your backend processing as well as trading partners on the on the right hand side looking at e-commerce platforms or potentially some other visibility platforms right whatever applications you're talking about that you use today for your business we help you stitch all together with a single platform and when we say uh, ecosystem enablement we're talking about providing both the technical data movement as well as visibility into invisibility that allows you to see the technical transactions as well as gain valuable business insight into that data as it's being transformed and passed through the cloud. So when we start taking a look at what we're what we have, we're going to take a look at really quick the CIC cockpit. And as I switch over to the cockpit, you can see here that this is uh, we've got our standard dashboards here. Uh, this can be really whatever is valuable to you guys. So what we're looking at is I've got some some different document types and some different graphs here, but. When we start looking at the business value and the, really the end to end visibility, we're talking about being able to consume the information and be able to provide that business value. So as you can see, we have these different tiles that are showing us different invoices, as well as some very unique data about those invoices. So when I click down into one of these invoices, right? So this information is gathered as that data is passing through the cloud and being transformed, whether that be from an API uh, call that we've pulled the data in or an EDI document that's being uh, submitted by a trading partner. So here we have the ability to grab whatever sort of information out of that data and populate it up to the cockpit. And, and from an end to end visibility perspective, you're, you're able to see not just this one document itself, right? We searched by that one document, but we're able to see on the left-hand side with our TripIt view, all of the subsequent documents and previous documents as part of this document lifecycle. So we know that this invoice had a couple other documents with it, a purchase order, order acknowledgement. It could be a load tender to invoice with a, you know, a different uh, load tender statuses or other documents associated with your process. So as part of this, right, that, that business flow and the technical flow, you're able to gather all that information in the same screen. So at the top really is more of the business flow here. But when we start looking down here, you're able to gather that business level information, being able to see where the document originated, it was transformed successfully, and it was sent out to a trading partner. So when we start looking at being able to leverage all of this information, you're able to reduce you know, your error handling times, you're able to empower your customer service reps to be more, um, to be more efficient and in increasing customer service and customer satisfaction. So when we take a different look at it, right? When we start looking at it from a holistic perspective, if we go back to the messages, right? We can look at all of the transactions that are happening in the system. So we're able to gather information about everything, whether it be good or bad, something that's happened, right? We're able to get that information from a single place. And, and if I wanted to drill down into some of that information, let's say maybe I wanted to go look for a specific trading partner. If I wanted to go look at, the, let's say Amazon, for example, I can filter by my trading partner. I can see all of the orders that have come in from Amazon today. And, and in this particular case, we're using our API integration to go fetch information from Amazon and we're pulling that information in. You can see here that we've gathered some, some technical data around what specifically uh, the order contains. And I can drill down into this tile and look at and see a little more information about what we've captured. Now, again, this is up to you guys and is customizable as to what information is provided to us. We can populate it here. But again, you can also see at the bottom a technical view of, hey, we reached out to this Amazon marketplace. We transformed this data for our backend ERP and we delivered it to the backend system. So the beauty of all of this is that we can actually get even deeper down into that message and provide real visibility from, from a trading partner perspective. We can see that, hey, this, this has been delivered on the back end side, but if we want to look at, we can actually grab the, the technical payload from this document and see this is the actual order information from an API perspective that was delivered. So in summary, really what we're talking about doing is really eliminating a lot of these manual processes because what, what we've seen in the past is people build these custom flows. When we start looking at these types of integrations, they build a technical flow and plug it in and they, they, they're able to achieve getting the data in, but it's a manual process and that not one that you wanna maintain over time because 
as we've seen, right, the, with the growth of e-commerce, it can quickly become unmanageable to try and get all that information or have a human into that, right? Because then it becomes error prone. So you really need an automated approach to be able to plug in and pull that data, transform it accurately and plug it in with visibility so that you know if something goes wrong. So the idea behind what, what Clio is providing is into invisibility and allowing you to eliminate all of the complexities around the different types of integrations that you guys need for your business today. Thanks again. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Request a personalized Clio demo today.